Hello you guys, I hope you all are doing well. I wish you great divine light and healing. Luminous Guide is all about, you know, uh, focusing on the light within because outside your auric field, there is light, there is darkness, there is everything and so it is in us and this is focusing your light which is within you. Uh, so today's reading is going to be pick a card reading or pick a pile reading on uh, what is it that you need to let go of or what is it that you need to release and what is it that you need to embrace which is starting from tomorrow which is February 1st. Also uh, February 1st being the, the, the new moon okay where we will be doing the new moon manifestation all right and um, thanks a lot for a lot of people who do pay me to do rituals for them which is uh, you guys are really generous you you want me to help you manifest a certain uh, you know roadblocks which is there in your life and open those roadblocks so like those career opportunities or relationship but i do not appreciate people who call me or text me and want me to do spell work or black magic work where it harms somebody else's will and it is against somebody else's well-being i will never encourage that and never do that i do not wish to make millions i'm very happy with the amount that i make doing good, the good work you know bringing in the good vibe in okay so please uh, this is just a little uh, disclaimer that it did upset me when i and i got a lot of calls they were ready to offer me three times more than i generally charge so i it's so sad that social media does offer this kind of uh, lame opportunities but I do not this is just me okay this is just what I think and this is my perspective and the way I deal with my life so it, rest all is with you know whatever you think okay however let's not get that negative energy in this reading this reading is going to be about from 1st of February which is the new moon manifestation what is it that you really need to let go of and what is it that you need to embrace in your life as usual we have three piles right now okay so pick to the stone that you're drawn to or number one two three okay so I'm gonna keep this here this is amethyst number one put this here black tourmaline number two and clear cards number three i'm also going to pull some more cards that's going to help you decide what is it that you need to embrace or you need to work on and what is it that you really really need to let go of things that is really not good for you that's not serving you right and many of you need to let go of wanting to control somebody else please don't do that it's so sad i mean i i was not really upset but i was hurt you know to know that people want to play with somebody else's free will if somebody has to leave you and do not want you in their life let them go you've tried right let them go don't block that and don't get ego and narcissism you know in your head space it's it's just generating bad karma you guys just generating bad karma don't do that okay so i'm going to keep the cards displayed here so you can just take a moment take a deep breath you can pick more than one all right you don't have to just gravitate towards one if you feel that you are being drawn to all three maybe there's a message for you in all three you know you never know you can pick more than one close your eyes take a deep breath and just intuitively pick either one two three all three or whichever is calling out to you okay so let us start it's 414 okay let us start with pile number one so if you pick this amethyst this is your reading all right confidence is your key success so right off the bat i see that you need to accept confidence you need to you know Put your case forward put your right foot forward with confidence in your life and if you have any fear-based emotions that's pulling you down i think that's what you need to let go of leo you know when you have the new moon in leo and this particular energy this animal energy which is the lion energy it talks about leadership it talks about um 
you know leading the tribe it talks about self strength it talks about self love an animal does not um an animal uh, an animal like lion they do not uh, what do you call that they do not hunt in uh, in in group they hunt alone right you can hunt alone you can get what is right for you all alone you do not need uh, of course you need guidance in life but you do not need somebody pulling you down is what i'm getting pulling you down yes that's the message that i got thank you spirits new moon in leo so definitely there's a new moon card come you should maybe journal down tomorrow all the things that you want to manifest and let go of things that holds you down that pulls you down and that makes you feel that you're less light enough you're like the king of the jungle so you are the king if somebody's making you feel like a rat that is the situation that you need to let go of is what i'm getting okay see three of cups there is a huge amount of celebration coming ahead so post this new moon manifestation whatever you desire you hope and you dream for there is definitely a celebratory moment for you you're going to achieve that win that you just got to have that confidence because confidence is your key and the message is from krishna lord krishna look at this beautiful image trust your spiritual guidance maybe a lot of you do have a spiritual guide uh could be an animal spirit could be a real person whom you connect with on a daily basis or always like for example somebody like me who who is a mentor okay so you do have spiritual guidance your commitment has been recognized so whatever hard work that you were doing is going to come into fruition you are loved unconditionally but you stop blocking the love that you're receiving that is another message that i got from spirit guides there is definitely a lot of celebratory moment three of cups beautiful energy just be confident and let go of fear based emotions is what i'm getting for you guys okay so if you uh, did resonate with this please like share subscribe to my channel comment claim okay claim your reading and i'll meet you in the next pile all right hello pile number 2 if you have chosen this black tourmalin this is your reading <laughs> communication is the key so what you need to embrace is communication you need to communicate clearly maybe some of you who've tapped in here is of gemini energy but you know you're also getting a new moon card like pile number 1 has also got a new moon card so great for you to start manifesting tomorrow i think whatever you want to do in communication speak with love speak with kindness be confident so uh you know if you think you're blocked your throat chakra is blocked you're not able to put your words over there you need to work on that okay and you need to let go of fear that okay if i say this what will the opposite person think let it be you at least speak your truth let them decide for themselves what is it uh, that they want to think about you so communication is your key i think what you also need to stay away from is people causing chaos and trouble in your life there could be a missing leadership here uh so there is some sort of missing leadership maybe your leader has been acting funny with you or you have lost the leadership quality over the interim so i think you need to communicate because you can see there's a lot of chaos happening in this card there is some sort of miscommunication happening okay and 5 could be your number so you really need to communicate get that grip back get that leadership quality back and let go of what people are talking behind your back it is not important and holds no relevance in your life okay that is what you need to let go of and then we have see higher learning melchizedek you have learned from your experience more in a study is now required to further progress so maybe you got to do your research well before you communicate with a group of people and you get back to the leadership quality so got to do your research really well understand what has caused chaos and problems in your life and then move ahead with you know your words all right so pile number 2 this is your reading please like share subscribe to my channel hit the notification i can claim number 2 if it is if you resonate if not please pick another pile Hello pile number 3 if you've picked clear cards this is your reading adjustments are required third quarter moon okay so i think a lot of you could be just uh you know adjustments i find over here in a very good manner for example if you want to place your case there's like a negotiation that you need to do which will be a win win situation for both the parties okay metaphorically speaking could be literally for some of you as well 
so uh you know so for example you and your partner sleeping on the same bed and um and you're snoring and your partner's being disturbed so maybe you want to go and get a health check you know you know what i mean in adjustments here so that kind of adjustments could be required okay uh, not compromise adjustments think about that so what you need to let go of is that whole attitude that you're not ready to you know go ahead and uh, make an adjustment is what i feel and queen of wands beautiful card so there is a lot of passionate fiery energy in you what you need to bring forward is that energy that you've been missing all along okay uh, the whole planning the whole nurturing the whole you know um, healthy competition is what you need to start manifesting and getting in your life i see a lot of you could be manifesting some sort of passion that was missing and that will come back in your life and also because you will start making these adjustments you will not like settle for less so you need to work upon what is it that you're settling for and i see a lot of you are spiritually guided here maybe you have a mentor or maybe you are a cat lover or maybe some of you could be getting a feline uh, animal in your dream that could be guiding or helping you okay that's a possibility you could be connecting to your spiritual totem okay and see mother mary love and peace look at this beautiful card let go of the need to be right see here this is back it's resonating here let go of the need to be right always choose peace bring healing in your life so a lot of you need to get the healing back in your life pile number three is what i sense here okay uh, if you've enjoyed this reading like share subscribe claim number three or you can also check number one and number two i love you all till we meet again goodbye